Hey everybody, welcome to another Warhammer Age of Sigmar Battle Report. I'm back with the Owen for Game with the Cooler. And today we're throwing down um, our phase one, sort of like thousand point level uh, New Year New Army project. So New Year New Army, I picked Slaves of Darkness. I'm doing a undivided army um, of Akron the Warp Rider and his like, his, his Chaos Cav basically. And you decided to go kind of lore heavy and you Paragon picked- Paragon Overlord. You, but, but not. <laughs> you picked you picked your favorite story from the Gloom Spike Gids book, which yes, is about- took, uh, Barak Kazar made terrible life choices. <laughs> they, they went into holes that they shouldn't have gone into, and something came back out. It's it's kind of like screamers. Can I come with you? Yeah. Can I can I come with you? <laughs> so you'll see you'll see when we actually show you the armies. Um, we have our first thousand points. Then we're gonna play some games, and then you'll see the next phase. We're gonna go to fifteen, and then two thousand. Uh, so this is our project to play some new armies and just try something new and something different. So we're not we didn't pick like top tier armies. We didn't want to do anything like that. We just wanted to pick something that was fun. I've had a cast project on the go for a while, and I wanted to paint. And then you've been really excited about like the lore in the Gloom Spike book, and this was just a really cool opportunity. So we'll share the armies, share the table, and get this underway. Here's Akron the Warp Rider, my general. Um, it's a Chaos Lord on Karkadrak, I think it's called. Made up dinosaur name. Um, I've done my uh, guys in a kind of, I don't say like flexible color pattern. So I've, I've done some silvered armor with some red trim, sort of red tabards and stuff. Uh, and that means that if I want to build into a cult army later on, I mean, they could be kind of corn, they could be kind of Nurgle, they could be kind of Slanesh. Their armor's dirty, right? They're just kind of, they're just kind of nice and neutral. It's uh, it's a, it's a nice look. <laughs> so uh, he's my general right now. I'm doing the Ravager's Legion because it's kind of the only one that makes sense for the the Chaos Warrior heavy build that I want to do. Um, and eventually I'll run into the, was it the Horde of Ruination? The one with the, the all-cav one basically for my War Scroll Battalion. Um, and I also have a, um, a uh, Chaos Warrior Lord here with just like standard gear, but I'm going to give him the Master, is it master of... Deception. Don't worry, he's minus one to hit melee because the Ravagers give, the, give out uh, command traits to all the other heroes as well. So he'll, he'll get the minus one to hit one. And we'll have the Fueled by Hatred. So we're 11 wounds on this guy, which is pretty awesome. Then for battle line, I got a 15 man unit Chaos Warriors uh, with full commands and double hand weapons. So we can reroll our saves until we get down to nine guys. Uh, so it'll take at least 12 wounds before that happens. And then uh, we're plus one to run charge for our horn. Um, plus one bravery. So bravery, I think, eight base for the banner. And uh, the champion, of course, get an extra attack. Got a Gorby's Chariot, some of that sweet, sweet impact hitting. Uh, I'll get to double down on that when I finally have my War Scroll Battalion, too. But he gets to pick uh, all units within one inch, basically. Take D3 Mortal Wounds on a 2+, plus, which is a pretty awesome ability on the charge. Uh, the Carcadrack has that as well, actually. So both these units can go into multiple units, and everybody takes D3. <laughs> and then over here, you know, Chaos Knights. Uh, they'll benefit from his command ability, which is uh, Knight of Chaos. So he gives them plus one to hit and reroll charges for a CP which is pretty great. And then I got a Malevolent Maelstrom just around my last 10 points because I didn't have anything to spend it on. Um, and that is a thousand points of Slaves Darkness. And here's almost a thousand points of Caradron Gitzer Lords, Gitadron Caralor, <laughs> Goblin Sky it's, Pirates. It's Gloom Spite Overlords. <laughs> Gloom Spite Overlords. They're from, uh, what's the what's the Skyport called now? Something uh, Moon? Barak Kazar. Yeah. The, the Moon City. The Moon City now. Yeah. So, so what do we got in our first thousand uh, points? We've got the Admiral in the front there with his squig parrot. He has the Aether Charge rune and he's a champion of progress. Uh, <laughs> he does look like a champion of progress. We've got an Endrin Master, um, two groups of Guns, Grunstruck Thunderers as my battle lines because I'm playing uh, Barak Nar, and then the I Arcanaut Ironclad. Oof, Avir covered in goblins and spiders and various other things. So you haven't decided how you're going to base these guys yet? Um, you know what? Put some ideas in the in the comments here. There's some lots of different choices, but his basic paint scheme here was some brown primer, and then you've done uh, some silver with some athermatic blue, I think, for the undertone. Yes. And then you got some typhus corrosion, and I think the what's it? The rise of rust. Yep. For the rust and stuff, and then there's pretty pretty awesome simple conversions. The old uh, plastic night goblin heads for the the characters. And some uh, some of the new heads from the Squig Hoppers. That's right. Uh, that head, the mask is heads, yeah. The boss head, the one on the admiral, is from um, the Squig Herders, mm -hmm. who come with them. Uh, we've got the old Goblin artillery crew sitting on the back of the Arcanaut, yep. carrying rocks and steering the ship. Yeah. We've got Doom Divers up top. Some we've 40k got, bits. Uh, some 40k pieces. There's some 40k heads in the uh, in the Endrins that yep. I didn't bring this time, but. Still, yeah. still working on the conversion. It's kind of a, a big project, and then of course a, a cool symbol, of course, need to be painted on here too for some sky pirate But what an awesome theme! 
right, and so we're deployed for three paces of power. We got one, two, three, three inch or six inch zones um, across the table. Could be held by heroes only. You score number points equal to number of turns consecutively. You held it for each turn that you hold it, and if you leave it, you immediately stop controlling it. You'll claim control if a hero slays the hero that took control of it in the zone. Um, and for deployment, it's 12 inches on, basically. So it's halves, 12 inches away from the enemy territory. Uh, I got Acheron, the Warp Rider, his Knights, 15 Chaos Warriors with my Sorcerer, and then my um, Gorbeast Chariot over here. The Overgets, the Gloom, the Gloom Lords, <laughs> deployed all in their, uh, what is it, Ironclad? Yep. Hanging out in the corner. So we are, I think I, you finished first. I did. I'm going to go first. I'm going to go first. All right. Do it. Hey, is you gain two CBs? Uh, you have one, one already? But then I get uh, another one for each hero on a four plus. Sweet. I get another one. So I got two. Starting for my spells, I have the Chaos -y Teleport spell on him. Uh, he has the Gear Strike on his axe because we're from Garan. And then um, he has Bolster by Hate and he has Master Reception as our, uh, our traits. For your traits, anything? Uh, we have the last word That's on right. the Ironclad. Yep. We have. Um, the Aethermatic, not Aethermatic Rune, it's, yep, Aether Charged Rune, and he's the champion of progress on my Admiral. Got it. And now Moving. we're going to fly high, and fly across the board, away from Scary Monster Man, and hang out peacefully over here. Nice way. Not bothering nobody. Okay. And then uh, we're going to shoot. Uh, going to spend a command point. We're going to make our good friend, the Ironclad, reroll ones to hit with his guns. Okay. Uh, I have to double check that it's not make your guy, target your guys. It might be mine. He's nope. shooting. He, him and the gunners are the only ones in range. But we're going to do the Ironclad first, and he's going to shoot his guns. He is also going to spend his, uh, his moon er gold. Yeah, his, his moon gold. On, his moon uh, cheese. Reroll to wound. Okay. He's going to fire his main gun at that guy. Little whiz. Uh, oh wait, he's minus one to hit, isn't he? He sure is. Oh, so I'd be hitting him on fives. Real ones. Yeah, that's pretty bad though, because he's probably got a pretty decent number of wounds. Yep. Hmm. You know what? I think we're just gonna bludgeon the unit of dudes. Okay. So we're gonna fire our um, carbines and torpedoes at this guy, and then the main cannon at them. Cannon shell, hitting on threes. Yep. Wounding on threes. Rerolling because we spent our er, our dollar dues. Er gold six six and minus one. The great sky cannon firing shrapnel. So I have ten or more models in this unit. So I have a minus one for five plus, but I reroll all my failed saves. And six so three damage. Six damage. So three guys die. Uh, one two three. Firing at the horse. I haven't had a hero phase yet, so I haven't had the opportunity to make him the general. Yeah. Go ahead. Hitting <laughs> on threes. Rerolling ones because the general said so. And then wounding on threes, re-rolling because we spent our dollar dues. Five at minus one on two. Five at minus one, so five five ups. And pass two. Six damage. Got two left. Zeros. Hitting on fours, re-rolling ones. One hit, wounding on threes. One at minus one. One five up. Nope. D three. He lives. Damage. Just he making lives. the gore beast angrier. Squad in the, in the side, the gunners. Yeah, they're going to shoot. We're going to put, um, they have 12 shots because their boss has a double tap gun. Mm -hmm. um, they normally would have 10. We're going to put, let's say, six into the Gorbies and then the rest into the guys. What's your range? 18. Okay, okay you're good. Uh, it might actually be 24. It's, uh, I think we spend our dollar redo as well. So Ergold they, reroll wounds. Ergold reroll wounds. They don't have rerolls to hit those, so they're hitting on threes. Good, good job, boys. This is against the chariot. Yep. Wounding on fours, but they are re-rolling that one. One, two at minus one. Oh, come on! Five ups! Nah, he never loses the bonus on. Just dies. Nice. Into the Chaos Warriors. Miss. And then fours. Re-rolling. Two at minus one. Two at minus one. Fives. Re-rolling everything. Nope. Just one. Wound. Yep. Yeah. So somebody's wounded. And they're just going to put all 12, and they'll spend their dollar redo as well. Okay. Threes. Good job, Captain. <laughs> Way to get those hits. Fours. Fours. We're rolling. And we got five. Okay, five. Fives are rolling. Fives. We're rolling everything. So two more. So somebody's wounded, and I've got 11 guys left. That's your turn. Oof. Well, it's a battle shock test. Uh, we're bravery eight. We've lost four guys. So that's going to be a four or less to pass. 
No, oh, there's a guy. Okay, turn one chaos. Well, we got a CP. You kill one more. I know. <laughs> uh, we got a CP. Uh, we're gonna choose this jabroni to be the general for this round, uh, meaning that all ranges are measured from him. And I guess we start moving. Never mind, that guy didn't run. He's uh, within 12 inches of a lord. Doesn't have to be the general uh, to be mean to battle shot. So let's do some hero phase stuff. We're gonna start off with. Oh, I don't know. Some sweet, sweet. Make these guys reroll hits and wounds. Uh, power of darkness, magic spell for me. Doesn't go off. Let's do some movement. Uh, he's gonna be my general for this round, and he's gonna run. Whoa, he only goes seven. Forget that. Let's spend that CP and make him go uh, plus six. He's gonna go eleven. So this plus three made it. Where's he gonna go? Uh, they're gonna go there five. How far away am I? I'm roughly that's eight, probably fourteen away. So I have to roll a nine to charge you. Let's try it. I get plus one to charge. We're plus one to charge. If I hard roll an eight, I'll get in there. Go get them, fellas. For the Dark Lord of Mordor. Run. They're gonna go plus two, so they go a total of twelve. And they're just gonna go four. Four and four. Hang on, next to the boss. Okay, get that. Yeah, get that. That please don't kill me. The shooting thing that we do. Uh, Mr. Crackerjack's gonna go. He's gonna run as well. And go plus five. Might as well just go take this. And we go nine plus five. Just gonna go touch that. All right, and we've used our CP now, so no rallying the tribes this turn. Uh, but I might go again, which would be nice. So shooting phase, haha, <laughs> we're chaos. And then a charge a clock. Let's charge in and try and get the sign clad. Um, they get plus one run charge because of their horn, which means I will charge you on an eight. And we got it with an 11. So let's go in. So we're gonna this plus three. Right, do I get to pick first? So let's just uh, do some sweet, sweet piling in as we do. And we'll just keep wrapping around this thing. And these guys are going to go this way. Head and left. Head and right. And I think this one, oh, these, these uh, three sorry. won't get. Sword? It's on threes. Wounds on threes. Two. Two. At minus one. Minus one. So I need fives. Rolling everything. Yep, we're good. There you go. It's all but these three are in. So that's two, four, six, eight. It goes to 16, 17 for the boss. Attack your general, I think. Because you only have cover in the first round of combat. Oh no, your plus one saves are cover. Is it Both. cover? Plus one saves and minus one to hit. No, no, but minus one isn't cover. Plus one saves is cover. I'm gonna go into the plane, I think. So we've got uh, 17 attacks. Threes. Reroll all my fail rolls to hit, because I got two hand weapons. Did they reroll the wound as well? No, that's what I was trying for the spell for. Oh, I see. Uh, but we just 16 times, yep. <laughs> and then we wound on threes. Yep. And if I have my foot here, I can have them fight twice. But I don't. Uh, so that's going to be... 12. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Yep. Three plus. One, two, three. Three? Cool. Yes, yeah, fifteen wounds. Ooh. Well, uh, I guess I do an attack back. We'll attack with the Admiral first. Three attacks hitting on threes. And then wounding on twos. Minus two. two. Minus two. So six is rerolling. Okay. Two nope. damage. Two damage. Okay, kills this guy and one goes over. And then we'll have the Endrin Master go. He is three attacks hitting on threes. One hit, winning on threes. Minus one. Minus one. Nope. Uh, nope. And re-rolling. Nope. E3. Two wounds. Two wounds. So this guy's gonna die. And we'll kill this guy. Ugh. So are you minus one, or no longer re-rolling? Can we kill them? Uh, here? I'm at two, four, six, eight right now. Yeah, you're good. Sweet. So we'll have the uh, the Arcanaut Duders go. Let's hitting on fours and fours. One bap, no mods. Not for boss. Nope. The sergeant's gonna hit you with his drill bill. D three attacks, three attacks. Hitting on fours, wounding on fours. Nothing. And then same thing from the other team. So D three on the red dice. 
So two hits and one attack, which misses. And then two wounds, normal saves. Normal saves. Uh, so two four ups. Good. And, and he has his. I, I forget what they actually call it. It's like uh, boarding weapons. That's it. I have taken three wounds, so yep. we're still at peak boarding weapons. Oh, I forgot to do my bombs. Uh, is it only in the charge phase? Bombs. Two plus, you take D3 mortal wounds. Got it. Take two wounds. Okay. From the guys riding it. Fours. And fours. Three normal saves. Prop. Good. Yep. <laughs> and that's All right. it. Well, then we are uh, down three. Courage eight. Seven, we're gonna score two. And it's top of two. Let's see who's going first. There's no way I mean. <laughs> Four. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. This is me. Well, we got a CP. All right, everybody. We'll make him the general again. Let's do some moving. So these guys are gonna go. Uh, they're gonna go there 10. So this plus two, we'll just give me the corner of that. Like so. Everybody else is gonna come around. Move forward a little bit just because I want to still touch the zone, but I want these guys to be holy with an 18. And this little guy is just gonna move over to here. Oh, sorry, I should cast a spell. <laughs> Do it. I'll try and dark glory them, make them cap go big. Nine. Silence. Eleven. Got it. I'm no longer rerolling hits and wounds with these guys. Uh, and then it looks like Charging. we are just gonna have to spend our. <sighs> so if I spend a CP on them. They'll get plus one hit and they'll reroll charges. But I don't think they're gonna make it. Well, 10 with two chances here if I do this. My other option is to bring a new unit down. And I think I bring a new unit down instead. I'm just gonna try and roll it. I'm going to rally the tribes and we're gonna bring in um, a unit of iron golems back on the flank. Uh, and I gotta try and charge my knights. So I am looking for a big fat 11. I need a 10 because I'm plus one for my horn. And I get to. Uh, one chance here. Give me it! Oh, so close. 11 total, or sorry, 10 total, and that's six, and then five more. I'll make it within a half. Yeah, 10 total. No, don't make it. Eight, a dollar short. Let's pound and fight. All right, I'm gonna remember beginning of the combat phase yep. when I drop my bomb. Two plus. Two plus. D3 mortal wounds. Two. Two. Kills the guy. Wounds another guy. And we all pile in, so we're all throwing pile in. spiders off the side. Yeah. For the record. <laughs> That's right. It's not actually bombs. The bombs stopped working ages ago. They don't know how to make them. They're, they're rusted onto the side. That's they're right. actually terrified. They're, they're, they don't know what to do with them. <laughs> they make strange ticking noises and they scare them. Vote again. 15 tacks back into the boat. Yeah, we're just going to try and, try and cripple those things. If we can get you out of it, then big, big troubles. Threes. Really? Rolling over then. Sweet, sweet paired hand weapons. And then threes to wound. Let's make you roll some ones and twos. There we go. So it looks like five, nine. Three. Should fail three of these. Oh yeah? How about five? Oh, ho, ho, I'll take it. <laughs> Eight wounds I'm total. into it. Yep. I, yeah, I can't fly high. Can't fly high now. Oof, we get it. Well, I'm going to heal. Yeah, you might have to get out and heal yet. This man. He'll take his swings again with his big uh, hammer stick on threes. Ooh, that does just mortal wounds, I'm pretty sure. Never mind. That's the Aaron Ringer. Uh, and then twos, one at minus two. Six up. Uh, two damage. Okay, so this shifts over. Engine Master on threes. Two hits and then threes. One at minus one. Nope. Two wounds. Squad the first. D3 attacks on the red dice. So two on fours. Actually, that's good that I rolled those separately. And then fours to wound. This one is, I believe, minus one. And the other two okay. are normal saves. Five up. Nope. Four up. Pass the other ones, so this guy does. And then the big one does D3, because they're using chainsaws. Two. Okay, one more. Oh no, sorry, it's just one, it's D3 attacks. Just oh, one, okay. one damage. Just one it, damage. Is, it is minus one, but it's one damage. Okay, so he just takes wound. Go oh, man. Two attacks, so it's all the same now, I know that. So these are then all forced to wound. Three normal saves. Two more. more. So he's dead, and whoa, and we'll have horn guy get wounded. And then the ship attacks. Or it's uh, we'll do champion get wounded. And it's taken eight wounds, so it's only got six crew left. Fours. And fours. One more normal save. Four plus. 
Oh, killed the champ. Ow, uh, lost five, still courage eight. Three less were okay. Nope, bye. I'm a two, I'm gonna score four more, because I've held these for two rounds now, and go to six. Yep. All right, well, first off, the Aaron Riggers are gonna get busy and heal this guy for one, back to 11. Then the Rider is gonna heal it for D3 more, for two more, back to 13. And I think that's it for the hero phase. Oh, and then do we get more command points? We get one, one for the round and then one more. The rigger is going to climb out of his car within six. And then a squad of gunners are going to get out with him. Because it's dangerous to go alone. Stay here. There we go. Deep strike instead of flying? Yeah, we can fly again because we're we're not that badly hurt anymore. We've only taken five wounds at this point, which is better because I believe I can fly high. Yeah, so long as I've taken less than seven. So they're gonna do it, and they're gonna fly over here. Inside of nine. And be outside of nine. Hello, space plane. Look on the admiral. He's going to make his sky vessel reroll ones to hit, and then it is gonna open up. I think we just shoot everything into that guy. <laughs> we you just, can. We just try and kill him. Do it. Um, I think the only thing we won't shoot is we'll shoot the torpedoes at these guys. Sure. So we're going to shoot the main gun. What's his save? Is it really good? Three plus. Three plus, eh? I think, yeah. Right, so the flat six. Yeah. He has 11 uh, wounds, so. Threes, re-rolling ones, miss. And then threes again, no re-rolls. We spent all of our dollars. Three at minus one. Three minus one, three, four. Plus. Two uh, pass one, so four. He's got, uh, you got from 11, seven left. Open up with the carbines, hitting on threes. I didn't pull the one. And then threes. There's the one. Uh, six more at minus one. Plus. Two damage each. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. That, okay. That's tight. Was... Torpedoes into the horses on fours. Oh, they, they woke up. And then threes. Four at minus one. Okay, four or five ups. Uh, oh, sorry, he had a six up shrug against all that damage. 14 shrugs, yeah, because he's within range of the general. Sixes. I make one. I'm dead. Doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm over here, yeah. So, 3d3 damage. 3, 6, 7, 8. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, then you get shrugs as well. <laughs> Sixes. They make two. And I lose two knights. Shoot their rifles at, uh, at your guys, your knights. Sure. Hitting on uh, threes, wounding on fours. Good, good job, boys. Don't worry, you'll come through for me. Yeah, four. four. Minus one. Pow, pow, yeah, pow. Everything, sixes. That's one, so one guy. Shoot everything into uh, your knights again. Okay. Threes. And fours. It's lost. Carbine unit. Two, two, more. two more. Minus one. Minus one. Fives. There you good. go. I am out of guns. That was, that was Oof. it. Still don't score anything though. I Top. score one. Oh, you just score one. Right. Yeah, I forgot you dropped the guy off. I'll take my one dollar. And then go to the three. And then morale good. I'm immune because I'm within 12 to look. Oh, that's true. So he goes first. Give me that sweet, sweet double turn. Phase. I get a CP. I make these guys fight good. Cast spell. Yep. Real hits and wounds. Eight goes off. No. <laughs> it's going to run. Hey, uh, ha, ha, they're gonna go five, because they're slow. Oh, because they're iron, yeah. Because they're iron golems. All right, boys. <laughs> Just go get them. I'm gonna shields. go ten. I, I gotta kill this one guy that's causing you to score. If you're within three when they shoot. I figured. All right, so this guy, what do you want to do? Let's walk to the edge of zone. Be ready to do some, some stuffs. And then we're gonna charge. Go get him, Knightleys! <laughs> we gotta use it to reroll! That's an eight. That looks like Plus one. Good. Yeah, it's yeah. Lots, of, lots of good. Go get him! I see we go. <laughs> okay, so I've lost all my buffs, um, but I do have five attacks all in your character uh, from the champion and the rider, two inch reach. Sweet. Uh, hit on fours, and they are minus two, two damage. Winning on threes. Because we're using Lance on the charge. Hopefully you miss, because we're going to die on I know, that's the plan. <laughs> Fours. Oh, Lance. we didn't get enough. <laughs> and then threes. Two at minus two. Sixes. 
Four damage. Down to two. Uh, then we got four horsey attacks. Fours. Into their boys. Yep. They're mad. Should have piled them into the guy. Uh, two. Two saves. Four plus. Yep, that guy dies too. I have to actually pile in a bit. I'm not going to leave the zone. No, obviously. But I'm going to poop you with my stick. Mm -hmm. Three attacks on threes. Yep, three. Okay, thanks for coming out, buddy. And then gun butts. And then this guy will kind of wrap like that so that three of them can get in there. And they, the pointy man still has his little drill bit. And we're going to hit you with gun butts and the drill. So D3 from the drill and the gun butts. So three. Uh, one hit. One wound at minus one. Okay, five and up. two at no mods. Okay, five up. And then four up. One uh, damage. We're not, I think we're still holding within 12. Okay. No, it doesn't matter. One, so take one damage. Take a wound. Uh, you are minus one bravery for being near the Dread Knights. Oh, no, aren't you mean to battle shock next to an objective? Are you okay? I spend a dollar. Okay, I don't run. Okay. Three, I score three more and go to nine. Yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna just kill them all. <laughs> I guess you are. Do we get more command points? We get one because we get one. Two ca characters are still on the board, so we'll get another one. And heal one point on boat. Okay, so up 14. to fourteen, um, which means he's only taken four. But I think that still slows his movement. Why weren't you me? Yeah. How far uh, to go? He goes eight right now because he's taken four wounds. Cool. So he basically just flies to the other side of that wall. He's gonna fall back. He's gonna fall back to the far side there. And uh, we're gonna get into the shooting phase. So that little engine master is gonna go. He's gonna shoot his eyeball lasers at. Um, Are you gonna CP anybody? Oh yeah, I should. We'll CP the boat again. Okay. To reroll ones. Okay. That's the only one that really works. The start of phase. That's all. Yeah. yeah. And then we're gonna shoot uh, the gaze at that guy. Hits. Hits him. Twos to wound. Gaze of Grugney. Minus Wounds. one. Okay. Uh, five up. Good. All right. That was that's all he's got. Okay. Uh, the gunners are going to shoot. They get plus one shots because you're within three inches of them. Cool. Yeah, rapid fire. Because they stand their ground, and then one of them has another shot on top of that because he's got a or he's got four shots normally. There we go. Do it. Two, three, and the boss hitting on threes. These guys don't have their aether gold. It's the other guys in the yep. ship that do. Threes, shooting the horses obviously, and fours. One, two, three at minus one. Oof. Three, five ups. Six is a shrug. One, take Down two. Losing my banner. Combat phase. I, this has. Oh, that's a good one. Sorry. <laughs> I forgot you're trying to murder my guys. 700 points of my army hasn't gone yet. Um, do we even divide these up at all? How many wounds do these all have? One? One each. Yeah, there's 10 wounds there. We'll fire the cannon at them. Okay. And then everything else in your wizard. Cool. Um, actually, wait. Is this guy within 18? Oh my gosh, he's not. Damn it. <laughs> the cannon's the only thing that can reach him. Oh, the torpedoes do. We'll shoot torpedoes at him. Okay. So, cannon, carbines, torpedoes. Cool. So. Turn to the carbines? Pardon me? Carbines shoot 24? They only shoot 12. Oh, yeah, you're not shooting anybody with that except for him. Then carbines into him, okay. cannon into them. Okay. Tor no, torpedoes? Torpedo, carbine. Torpedoes shoot 24? Sh torpedoes shoot 24. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we'll do the torpedoes first. Then. Okay. Fours to hit. Rerolling ones. Threes to wound. Three at minus one. Three fives. D three. Three. Sixes. No, I'm dead. Pow. Right in the catcher. Carbines. Threes. Don't you dare. Nope. And threes. Oh no, sorry. That was fours to hit. Oh, I'm just gonna reroll it. Okay. I don't remember what I rolled. Uh fours to hit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then three sure. to wound. I'm sorry, I, I didn't expect that to happen. <laughs> sure. Six? Sure. That's okay. The, o the audience will sort you out on fives. <laughs> and then six on sixes. Uh, it's 12 damage. Uh, 12 oh, no, damage? It's only six, you only feel yeah. three. I feel three. Three. He's got two left. Uh, the cannon shell into these guys. Threes. Re rolling ones. And then threes. Three at minus one. Three at minus one. Uh, fours go to fives. Pass two. Two damage. Okay, two guys die. Ah, oh, sorry, two on the on the ogre. He has three. You always take the ogre first. I didn't fly within nine, so I can't shoot you with my boss. <laughs> so then the crew inside is going to shoot. Um, they're going to spend their dollar 
Three Three wounds. Roll to wound. Yep. Uh, that's nothing. That was just yeah, a save I made. Because he has three he wins left. Two wins left. Two wins left. Yeah, he's taking three. And we've got five, ten, twelve shots. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Rerolling because we're spending our dollar. Six more at minus one. Five ups. And then six ups. Make one. You did. <laughs> Do it. That boat's going to charge. We're going to spend a command point to reroll charge distances with our skyfaring vessel. Okay. And we need like a nine. Oh, I think probably like more. Ten away. Yeah, we need a ten. Yeah. We don't have our sky hooks, so no bonuses to charges. Ten. I have to reroll. You do. Ten. No. Damn it. Go to three. And I think if we maintain turn order, I think I win. You can tell me it won't matter. I'll be out on points. Uh, all right, let's see who goes first. Three. Six. It's me. Uh, so here, phase. We are going to. I just need to keep holding this. We're gonna cast uh, the teleportate. No, it needs to be with 18, so I can't do it. We're just gonna cast, I guess, a uh, arcane bolt on this guy. Try and give him a big bolt. Seven. No. <laughs> we're gonna stay as far away as we can. Go outside your guns. Uh, these guys are just gonna run onto the zone. Just take it from you. Oh, man. <laughs> They're the worst. I mean, they were free, so I can't really complain. Everybody, everybody get in the zone. That's my turn four. I score four more and go to 13. We will. Moon hero phase. Uh, do we get more CPs? We get another one, so we'll go to three. So many fun bucks. And yeah, I guess we just do one of these. Hello, everyone. You're not going to get out? Why? I can't score. That's true. Score, I guess, so yeah. it doesn't matter. Anymore. Yeah, it's true. Everybody gets it up close, snuggles in. And yeah, we're going to go with the big ship first. I'm just it's going to fire just his main gun, just the single shot. Okay. And then everything else into them. Do and we'll it. spend the dollar to reroll. Okay. Three to hit. Hit, two to wound, minus two. <laughs> Six up. <laughs> Six damage. Uh, Yahtzee. Yahtzee. <laughs> No, I got two. <laughs> He's dead. Else, these poor jabronis got called in at the last minute. <laughs> Carbine. I wasn't even supposed to be here today. <laughs> and then threes again. Five at minus one. Five at minus one. Five ups. Two, four, six, eight damage. Eight damage. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dead. Eight, because he got left behind. Nah, I forgot my dwarf. Or whoever that guy is. Score three more and go to six. And then next turn you can get out, you'll go four more and go to 10, 11, because he'll get out and take the zone on turn five. Well, on turn four, but 11 to 13, four chaos at the end of the game. So there you go, end of the game, phase one of our new year, new army, and I managed to pull off win by two points, even though I got tabled um, with the chaos warriors, just taking the places of power. It was it was fun to see the ironclad in action though. Hor oh, oh my God, it's horrifyingly fucking shooty. Like it is, it is a, a madness, a bunch of guns. Especially in a small point game, but what are you gonna do? My, mean, my chariot never left the table. The all two it, damage is what's crazy. Yeah. It's, it's eight plus six, two damage gunshots. Yeah, it's a ton. Threes. An absolute ton. And then another 4d3 potential damage on top of that. I think you did the right thing blowing your ur gold in the beginning or your aether gold in the beginning just to like try and alpha strike off as much stuff as possible. Because if the chariot had charged you and the general at the same time, your character would have died from impact hits because you're all within I, an inch of them all of a sudden. You get to shoot <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you can shoot them, but it's I mean... when you complete your charge, not the beginning of the charge phase. Uh, I'm like, it's, I do that when I charge, so my charge isn't complete until after it happens. Mm. So you'd probably die first, I think, because I pick an immediate after I move, before my, once I'm, yeah, I mean, once I'm done. It'll live. You might kill everyone around it. <laughs> well, that's, well, that's the thing, it's like, I'll just start dumping 2d3 wounds into the characters and stuff like that. Um, and once they're part of the formation, too, I can double down on some units, too. So there's there's some ways around the guys hiding inside the boat forever. Uh, I just have to not get shot to pieces <laughs> before that happens. <laughs> so anyway, um, we're going to do another one of these. It'll be on Owen's channel. Um, if you haven't seen it already, uh, I'll link it below. And you can check out another game where you're going to try out your frigates. You're all just... Four models Four army. Four model thousand points. <laughs> yeah. if, if one boat's good, three boats is better. So uh, we'll see you for that one soon. Enjoy like Style Mash the Zone. Have a good day. 
I hope you enjoyed that video. If you uh, want to support the channel, of course, like and subscribe and hit the little bell below so you get notifications when I post future content. I do post stuff seven days a week. Uh, if you want to support the channel um, further, you can, of course, buy a t-shirt through Spreadshirts, um, buy a measuring gauge or objective markers from Death Ray Designs. Um, or, of course, most importantly, there is Patreon. Patreon is what makes all this possible. Uh, keeps the lights on, pays for the studio costs, pays for the equipment, model costs, and everything else. And most importantly, um, puts food in my kids' bellies and a roof over their heads. Uh, big thanks to everyone past, future who supported me. Uh, I do this stuff because of you guys, and of course, I will continue doing it as long as I can.